what happened with me is then I was wearing a wig and people thought I had fabulous hair that always looked perfect because I was young, you know what I mean? <laughs> and so, you know, it just seemed like her hair is always perfect. But I literally woke up one day and I swear I heard a voice that said, you're done with the wig. And I thought, what? Are you kidding? Why? What is it hurting that I'm wearing this wig? But I trusted. And so I did not have cute stuff to put on my head like I do now. I had a bandana. And I got up that day, heard this, and just, and I, and I heard trust, trust, just trust. I'm like, oh my gosh, are you kidding me? So I put a bandana on my head, and I was going out that day and seeing a lot of people. Like, I was going to the library, I knew all the librarians, I was going to the dry cleaner, I was going, all these different errands that I was running, seeing all these people that see me every week. And my first stop was the library and I walked in and, you know, I could tell the look on their faces was we know her, we don't know her, like something's off, you know. And I'm walking in, the one lady went, Mish? And I went, I broke up with my wig. (laughs) And they were like, we didn't even know you had a wig. We thought you always had perfect hair. I'm like, no, it's $40. I can show you where to get it if you want one. But it was me. I stopped hiding. Hmm. That's how I looked at it. I was like, you know what? There's no reason to hide. This is who I am. If someone decides I don't want to be her friend because she doesn't have hair, well, what the heck is wrong with you? So, you know, it it just was me like showing who I really am. Mm 